In this video tutorial, I'm going to share with you a simple and profitable one minute trading strategy using just one indicator on trading view. So before we go further, I don't intend to make this video very long before I go into showing you this strategy. If you are new to my channel, if this is the first time you're seeing my video and you have not subscribed yet to the channel, please consider subscribing. Hit the notification bell to be the first to be notified each time videos like this are published. I do a whole lot of crypto content video trading strategies. So make sure you support the channel by subscribing to the channel. Hit the notification bell to be the first to be notified each time videos like this are published on the channel and if you are looking for a crypto exchange to trade with i recommend using bybit they are the best when it comes to derivative trading because of their low fee and other advanced features that they offer for traders so with that being said if you want to get the bybit account you can use the link in the video description and i equally have links to other exchanges where you can trade and start benefiting from okay so with that being said once you head over to trading view okay the first thing we want to do is to select our time frame and as i've said earlier this is a one minute strategy so head over to the time frame and make sure that you are on the one minute time frame and after that the next thing we need to do is to head over to the indicators tab and then here on the indicators tab the name of the indicator we're going to use is called the ema ribbon okay so once you type in EMA ribbon, you want to click on this one. You can actually favorite this to add it up to your favorite. Make sure you click on this one here by this creator. And once you click on it, that will be added to your chart. So once the indicator is added to your chart, this is what it looks like. And it comes with a 200 moving average that will help us determine the entries in this market. Okay, so before I go further in explaining how to actually use this indicator, the exponential moving average ribbon indicator is a trading view indicator that consists of multiple exponential moving averages plotted on a price chart as you can see here. Okay, so this consists of multiple moving averages that are plotted together. This tool is used to identify the direction and strength of a trend in the market. So as you can see here, whenever we are in, a, in an uptrend, you see that the ribbon indicator here will turn to green. And when we are in a downtrend, you see that it changes color to red. The EMA ribbon indicator is created by plotting several EMAs with different time period. All of these lines you see here comes with different time period. The moving averages here are stacked on top of each other, creating a ribbon-like appearance on the chart, just like you see, okay? <laughs> just like you see here, all right? So when the ribbon is sloping upward, it indicates that the market is in an uptrend. And when it is sloping downward, okay, it indicates that the market is in a downtrend. The EMA ribbon will help us to identify potential buy and sell signals based on the direction of the trend and the location of the price relative to the moving averages and as you can see on the chart here the moving averages ribbon indicator actually comes with a buy and sell signal all right so when we are in an uptrend you see the long signal and then when we are in a downtrend you see a short signal so it is as simple as this and we are going to be using this on the one minute time frame okay now when i hover over the indicator and i go to the setting tab here all right both on the style and on the input we're not going to adjust anything here i use this indicator with the default settings as it comes okay i don't make any adjustment here the only thing that i personally don't use when we go to the style option is the long and short signals you can see here on the chart all right so i just turn them off so the basic way i use this indicator to follow the trend of the market is the 200 moving average which is this thick yellow line here sells as my trend indicator all right because both in an uptrend and a downward trend you will always see okay a buy and sell signals from this indicator so i use the 200 moving average to filter out the noise in the market meaning that whenever this moving average or this moving averages that are stacked together creating this ribbon like appearance are trading above the 200 moving average i'm only looking for buy signals in as much as this is green okay whenever we get a green um all the ribbons that changes to green or all the moving averages changes to green we only take buy signals all right 
So to take sell signals, I only wait for the ribbon to cross below the 200 moving average and all of them should turn, okay, change to red, all right? When it changes to red, I look for only sell signals, all right? So you can actually use the buy and sell signals that appear here for confirmation, but basically I don't use them. I only use the crossover between the ribbon and the 200 moving average. So as you can see here, whenever the ribbon are trading above the 200 moving average, I only look for buy signals. And how do I get buy signals? Whenever all of these moving averages, okay, in the ribbon format actually changes to green, I take buy signals. And when there is a sell signal in as much as this is trading above the 200 moving average, I will ignore this and only take the next buy signal. So this would have been a winning trade, okay? So as you can see here, I have multiple entering points okay which would have ended up in profit so if i bring my long position to here this would have been a winning trade so if i bring my stop loss to the previous swing low okay this would have been a winning trade and this would have equally been a winning trade all right so once i bring my long position to so this equally would have been a winning trade and this as well would have been a winning trade okay so this will be a winning trade as I said earlier, once these candlesticks are trading above the 200 moving average, all we are looking for is for buy signals. And this would have been a winning trend. And if you have right this trend in the market, okay, this would have been an awesome move. Depending on your risk tolerance, this would have equally been a winning trade. All right. So this is the indicator that I use. It's just one single indicator. And I use this most of the time on the one minute time frame when I'm scalping the market. And this indicator have actually been of great help to me and i decided to share with you i want you to try out this indicator and whenever you get result please always share okay you can always share your testimonies on the telegram group join my telegram group if you want to learn more where i send out free signals or you can always use the comment section in the video to actually send in your testimonies whenever these indicators work for you this indicator actually work on all time frame but preferably I use it on the one minute time frame to scalp the one minute time frame. And whenever you're scalping, okay, your expectations of profit shouldn't be too much. All right. But when you see that the market continues to move, okay, with a very strong momentum to the upside, all you just need to do is to be dynamic in adjusting your stop loss and your take profit level. Okay, so when you adjust your take profit level to a higher target, always make sure that you adjust your stop loss in order not to get stopped at. So it's better for you to break even than to lose completely in the market. So once again, the way, the simple way to use this indicator is um, you can actually leverage on the buy and sell signals, but only take buy signals when the ribbon are trading above the 200 moving average and then a sell signal when it is trading below the 200 moving average. Okay, so when we are in a downtrend, you will see that all of the um, moving averages there will change. Okay. To red and when we are in an, in an uptrend you see that all of them will change to green so i hope this video is helpful if it is give it a thumbs up okay smash that like button and do share this with your friends okay so that is all i have for you in this video and i will see you guys in the next video